Hey everyone, this is Pankaj from CG Family and in this video, we are going to learn about Animex Pose. So in the previous video, we learned how we can transfer the animations through Atom Export. And I told you my offer more ways to transfer the animations. One of them was Anim Export. So in this video, we are going to cover that. So what we are going to do in this video is, we are going to transfer this jumping animation from this burglar character to our policeman character. Now like I mentioned in the previous video, these both characters are also going to be available on our Turbo Squid account. So if you want to buy them, you can go to our Turbo Squid account for that. Now getting back to top. First of all, if you didn't already, then go to Settings and Preferences, Plugin Manager, type Anim and load this Anim Export. Now let's put it on Auto Load and Close. So after you turn it on, now you can just select your animation and let's click export selection and we're gonna choose anim export here and we're gonna name this file jump. Now the main thing to focus here is this hierarchy. So I've only selected the hips. So if you want the whole animation, you can select below and then all cable and the time range should be all or you can say start to end and then mention like for example I say 75 frames. And we're gonna export the keys. Now after that just click on export and it's all done. Now all we need to do is, we can go to our policeman character, click on the skeleton and import the animation. So after pressing import, let's go to desktop, let's select jump animation and we have some option here also. So all these options, they'll come after you select Anim Export here. And now what you need to focus on is the frame rate. For example, my animation was done on 30 frame rates. So you can maintain the original or override to match the source. Now the animation range, it does not matter. You can combine the included source. If your scene has named spaces, then make sure to choose that and here you have some options you can choose the paste method to insert replace or merge so in insert it's only gonna insert the animation from jump in replace it will replace the animation if you have them on time slider or you can merge the animations we don't have any animations right now so we can either choose replace, insert or merge, it won't even matter. And then we can click on import. Now as you can see, the character took its pose. And if we play now, we have our animation transferred. That's how easy it is guys to transfer your animations through anim export. The only thing to keep in mind is that your scene hierarchy should be the same in source and your destination and it's always a good practice to check your namespaces other than that if you face any issues make sure to comment them down below to have access to our members only page on our website you can hit the sign up button it's totally free you can also support us on patreon which will help us bring more content to you guys this is it for this video guys if you like this video Please like, share and subscribe our channel CG Family and I'll see you in the next one.